by the time Serena is 13 years old, she'll probably no doubt be the number one uh, junior player in America, and that's going to bring in a lot of pressure. Stay tuned for CNN.com. 15-year-old Marion Jones may be the fastest teenager in America. And nine-year-old Serena Williams is one of the best pre-teen tennis players in the country. The two California girls are considered hot prospects to make big bucks in professional sports, and they know it. Monica Sella, she's a great player, and she's number one now. And she's only 16. She's the youngest number one. So I want to make a record just like she did, like be number one, like 15 or something. Open the stand. Open the stand. Right there, fit through. That's, there you go. That's great. Serena's current coach is her father, who says the family already has been offered million-dollar contracts by professional sports agents seeking to represent both Serena and her older sister, Venus. But despite living in gang-infested Compton, Richard Williams says it's too soon to talk money. If we accept all these millions of dollars that people are offering us, we won't have little girls no more. We'll have a business. And they're too young to be a business. The girls will sign contracts eventually, but the family feels there is time. By the time Serena is 13 years old, she'll probably no doubt be the number one uh, junior player in America, and that's going to bring in a lot of pressure, uh, 10 times more pressure than what we have now. Indeed, the pressure and its effects on these sports prodigies worries veteran observers. The competition is incredibly intense, the dollars are immense, and uh, it's the kind of thing where there can be a meltdown and burnout at a very early age. But for now, record-holding runner Marion Jones sees no such dangers. She says the only pressure she feels comes from herself. I don't run for anyone but myself. I think that you have to, that you have to enjoy what you do. I'm to excel in what you do. Jones, a 1992 Olympic prospect, still is just one of the kids at her high school. The question is how much longer the demands of today's sports world will allow her and Serena Williams to remain kids. Dan Blackburn, CNN, Los Angeles. Thank you.